enough to give you bad dreams for a few weeks. Probably will do. That's about as low as we've seen it during these championships. 7.762 for Wamis. But uh, like uh, so much in gymnastics, it takes a, a lot of courage to do the difficult things on these uneven bars. The higher bar at 2.45 meters, the lower one, 1.65, and there's uh, quite a lot of distance between the two. Yes, almost two meters, you know, 1.6 meters between the two bars. When maximum. you've got somebody in the gym, uh, you know, one of the young girls you're training there, getting them to make that uh, leap, that almost a leap of faith to start with between the two oh, bars. That, that's what um, every, all the youngsters work on single bar until they're about 11. And going particularly well here, Renska Endel. Yes, good. Full twisting double. Two, two somersaults, one twist. Often performed like a half in, half out, with a half a twist in the first and half a twist in the second somersault. But uh, hasn't affected... Wamers will be pleased about that. She hasn't affected the chemistry of the team. You know, Renska could get up there and be steely about her performance, and she wasn't unnerved by her teammate. This we're seeing is the endo in L grip, which is where the hands are rotated inwards, so the little fingers are towards each other. And the subtlety of the way the gymnasts grip the bars depends on the difficulty of the movement in many cases, that the conventional forward grasp, but a very tightly executed uh, dismount. Really good technique because she lands central to the position she takes off from. That was a release and catch, obviously. She did a whole element leaving go of the bar and coming back to catch it, which is, again, one of the special requirements in this rule book, which is called the Code of Points. And a little shy smile and a wave to the camera there from uh, Andal. She'll be back again in the apparatus final on those uneven bars. In fact, two Dutch girls, the one we're about to see here in the team competition too, amongst the uh, eight finalists for the individual gold on the uneven bars. 